Hi everyone, welcome back to Healing Days Oracle or welcome if you're new. Today we have a video which is not a pick a card, so if you clicked on this one, it's for you. It was for a reason. Those are messages from your future partner. Okay, so whether you think you know this person already or you're waiting for them to show up in your life, or just to try to understand what they want to say to you on a 5D level, where they are now, what's going on in their life. So we understand, you know, aligning your path together here. And we do have the divine feminine, divine masculine today because we do all have those both sides. We all have divine masculine, divine feminine energies. And I'm going to start with this and also adding other decks here my own decks have created my friends decks too so just to add on for you if you're new my name is josie i hope you consider subscribing all my links are below for to have a private reading with me or anything from my etsy shops the decks that i use today many others my crystals in front of you and all the details will be there for you so again it's not a bigger card so take what's donating leave the rest behind those are general readings but i always connect with my guides to help you no know, reaching out to your guides to be able to just help you with what's resonating for you. So again, without uh, any more delays, I do have other decks in front of me here. And we do start with the Divine Feminine here. So future partner, future spouse here. What's going on with this person? What do they want to say to you guys? What's going on that they may not be there yet? Queen of Pentacles energies. I'm strong, independent, and self-assured. This energy of the Queen of Pentacles, I feel like they could be stepping into their power and with the pentacles energy can be financial stability a lot of focus on the work as well and it can be something that's happening right now that is you know a lot of their focus right now so it could be someone that is single now or maybe you are single too and this energy of having to focus on building those security energies and also we do have the tree of sword energy i'm learning that separation is preparation for our union so if you guys are not together now and even if you have never met this person it's because you could be healing now from past connections difficult energies and this separation even on the 5d level you separated but you know this kind of energy that right now is separated but we will be together on the 5d you know anyway it's because it's to prepare you it's to help you to learn anyway so whatever's going on in your life right now in their lives as well i feel like it's preparation and the devil energy no person or situation has power over me i control my thoughts and if you are i feel like in expectation of this person being able to not get stuck with anything that's no longer serving maybe needed to forgive yourself forgive someone or just release control it has to be this way it has to be this person we can set intentions, we can visualize here who do you want to be with if you have a specific person in your mind. But just allow the universe, you know, to take care of it and have that flexibility that, you know, can be this person or, you know, someone even better for you. You know, just have that energy of flexibility with the universe as well. Ten of Swords, there are many energies of, you know, having to close difficult chapters. And um, you see, rising up, nothing can keep me down. You know, so especially if you have gone through difficult connections, it can be your energy coming here, their energy. So I do feel like they are closing chapters and it can be, you know, closing difficult situations, karmic ties, and even your side as well. Like I said, healing, being prepared. Then is a completion of a hard phase. So if you are in a hard phase right now or just knowing where your person is right now, completing this phase, rising up from the past. Okay, so nothing will keep them down. No person or situation have power so you could be stepping into a lot of power right now to be able to just manifest the right person release what's no longer serving heal energies here and ace of cups you see i'm ready for a new relationship with you so that's what i'm saying closing chapters to open new ones and the king of pentacles energies you can see here the king and queen you know i know that you want to treat me right so no doubt the partner here that is coming i'll leave the king and queen together here so I feel like it is really to confirm. This is something that really is meant to be. It's going to happen. It's a partnership. And oh no, it's a future spouse here. And really someone that's coming to balance. The king and queen energies really is something that sometimes doesn't happen as fast as we want because it really is the earth energies as well. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But just knowing that it's aligning. And it can be that you guys are working on your career finances, but it's definitely on closing chapters, stepping into the power, allowing healing, forgiveness, and being ready for this relationship. So your person is telling you, wherever you are right now, you know, we're both getting ready for our alignment, for our connection. And it's beautiful that it's coming, the king and queen. And we do have here, look at that, we do have the, the temperance, but also 
queen of pentacles coming again here on the divine masculine okay you seem to have everything together and sometimes that scares me because i don't okay so your person again having to step into that power okay so temperance also came here which is i must uh, do i must do things at my own pace because that is how i will follow through on my plans so asking for patience okay so your person on the 5d level asking for patience here because there's still things evolving growing developing here for you guys and interesting here double confirmation on the energies of earth so asking for patience and temperance here it's healing energy too balancing things out pros and cons and balancing from the past healing from the past so both of you are i feel like getting ready to align seven of cups you see i have choices to make but i will always choose you okay so and this could be on everything that's going on in their lives right now resolving things how fast they can go and and again, like releasing these energies of past third party situations. It really is someone that is aligning with you. Let me see here. Also, the Knight of Wands. You see, I'm making the adjustments required to change my life. So, no doubt there's something happening right now. Could be your life, but definitely on your partner's future partner's life here. Something is being adjusted, you know, and the Knight of Wands is that fire that focus to complete what needs to be completed and uh, fire signs aries leo sagittarius and temperance is also sagittarius energies the devil's capricorn energies just to give you those signs because it can be coming your signs their signs sun moon rising and it's definitely coming here strong king of cups i wanted to give you my heart no doubt here yes they can take their time here to be connecting with the energy of you know, balancing their lives, financial, resolving things. But it really is this energy of the heart is there, you know, to really align with yours. You know, their heart belongs to you. You're meant to be. You know, so I wanted to find space here for at least one more. So I feel like it, it's, there are many things happening on the background. Maybe you know, maybe you don't. Queen of Wands. And you are everything I could ever want. And it's interesting because we do have Queen of Wands energy and the Knight of Wands. And they're saying here that you seem to have everything together. And sometimes that scares me because I don't. And it can be that because they know you or because that's where they are in life. You know, step into the power or financial career here. But, you know, the Knight is still not feeling good enough yet for the Queen. So they wanted to give you the heart. But they needed to step into that power. They needed to work on the self, on the confidence as well. You know, this energy, it's aligning here. But it is a lot of patience as well. They're asking, king and queen energies. And uh, I do feel like it's it's getting there. They wanted to tell you that uh, they are aligning everything, resolving everything. And it can be that you feel it as well on your side. But the heart belongs to you. You guys are meant to be, of course, this future spouse. Let me see any other energies, anything. If they had the courage, what do they say to you right now? what's going on we are meant for each other this is true love okay so why are they saying this from the 5d or because you guys have met each other or when they will tell you how they feel they will be able to open their hearts and tell you how they feel it's someone that uh, knows you guys are meant for each other this this connection you know the feeling of belonging to each other the heart that they wanted to open up and give to you Getting ready for this new relationship or new phase of the connection. So many twin flame energies. I will come back to you. This is a promise. Okay, so this can be because they're coming back to you because you know this person or because they're coming from the 5D level. You guys already know each other from another past life, from so many energies, twin flame energies. Also, your love and energy can heal my heart. Okay, so this energy of helping each other, especially after hard times. Both of you could be coming from, like I said, you know, difficult connections. Both of you learning a lot here with each other, no doubt. Anything else I want to say to you? I miss out on someone so good. And it can be, again, for some of you that you are in separation right now. They are understanding. They miss out on you. What can they do to do something different right now? Healing. You are the most beautiful person in my life. Okay, so this can be, again, future uh, messages that they will tell you because this is something that they will reach out to you or they have the courage to tell you okay they quite resonating not everybody have met their future spouse yet and 
because so after so many heartbreaks, I hope this is true love. And it is true love is the energy of your future partner. But it's also, you see, the heartbreak energies. After the heartbreaks, it's when you manifest each other. And uh, could be for both sides, but definitely from their side. Okay, so in case you wanted to see what's going on in their lives right now. Healing, resolving things, trying to manifest each other. Let's see here. What else do I want to say to you? Messages from future spouse. I wanted to come back to our safe place. Let's work this out. Okay, so maybe you guys will have to work things out, especially if you're helping each other to heal and can be triggering. You know, sometimes when you are really trying to build the courage to be together, it's this energy of having to help each other. So they know you guys will really help each other. Even when, whenever, even if you have not met this person yet, you know, you guys will work things out and it can be ups and downs. Of course, every relationship, I just wanted to love and care for you. They do because they wanted to be with you, this future partner energy. They wanted to love, care for you. Nothing matters when I'm with you. It's that energy of knowing you belong together, knowing you're with the right person. Even if there are issues or things that you need to help each other to heal. Our best times are together. I love every minute with you. You see here? Enjoying the time with you. Being able to spend time with you. Quality time with you. So positive energies here. Also, let's make the most of every moment together. I feel like it's going to be important for this person to have quality time together. To plan things together. To really enjoy and travel together. Do many fun things together. So I feel like they're preparing for that positive time. Of course, all relationships have ups and downs and difficult times, but you know, they're preparing themselves. And the pain I've been through created walls around my heart. You see, it's someone that comes, you know, with uh, some walls around the heart and you're the one that helped them to heal as well, helping each other that way to open up. So I feel like you both are putting down the walls here. Let me put this king and queen together here because I have these two together here. King and queen, king and queen, many energies of king and queen. I also have, uh, you know, this energy of ace of cups here. The knight, the queen of pentacles is here twice. So I feel like it's a strong energy that you are aligning. So anything that you're doing now with your own life, healing, letting go of the past, trusting the divine timing, it's all to help you align. So a few other messages here from the person. You have, I love it when I catch you staring at my, at me. So it is, again, you know, the questions and it can be future messages. What they will say to each other. They will say to you. Also, I cherish every moment I spend with you. Again, here confirming. You know, making the most of every moment together. The best times are together. So no doubt, spending time together. Very important for them. And the first time I saw you, my heart whispered, that's the one. Okay, no doubt, the future spouse energies here they knew it from the beginning and maybe this was tricky for them scary i listen to music that reminds me of you for some of you that know this person they are in separation they could be scared because they knew from the beginning you're the one and they needed to prepare themselves you know like the the energy here of seeing you like the queen of pentacles very ready when they are not and also, I just wanted to grab your face and kiss you. Again, that energy of spending time with you, romantic, thinking about you. It's all here. Also, you mean absolutely everything to me. Okay, so this is not someone that's going to be holding or sharing their feelings with you. At least when they come, if you already know this person, after healing, they really open up their heart. You see the King of Cups energy. I wanted to give you my heart. They know you are everything I could ever want. You mean absolutely everything to me. So there's no doubt this person will cherish you very much. Okay. Also, there's so much about my feelings for you that I wanted to share. And this can be a process, you know, when someone is still learning to share their feelings after heartbreaks, you know, putting down the walls, you're helping each other to heal. It is a process. It's not always easy. But I feel like it's really here for you guys. And also, I can't stop thinking about you. Okay, so this can be, again, um, 5D energies, someone that's going to meet you in the future, someone that you guys already met. And one last message, I keep thinking of the last time we were together. And this can be because you guys know each other, because you know each other from other past lives. 
that kind of energy okay i'll take one last one to put here one last message from future spouse and i'm willing to put everything i have into this connection so this is someone that's not going to be holding back okay so maybe if you already know this person and they are not there yet they could be opening up healing closing the difficult chapters to put everything to this connection okay whether it's coming back to you or coming new into your life because you guys are aligning your path so just remember anything you're doing you know for yourself right now like i said you know, healing yourself letting go of the past forgiving yourself forgiving others just to step into your own power everything you are doing to you contribute into this connection send them positive energies whether you have met this person already or not because they are in a path of healing too closing difficult chapters so you can align sooner they resolve those things of both of you sooner you will meet there's a lot of powerful energies here stepping into the power aligning balancing so future spouse here really regarding you or they will whenever you come back together or whenever you finally meet really high cherishing every moment with you they wanted to give you the heart no relationship is perfect but this is someone that wants to be with you this is future part energy and it really is committed energy as well from the moment you know from the first time they saw you they knew their heart whispered that's the one i'll leave with these guys let me know if it helps you out if you want an extension of this reading for specific questions that you have my links are below for private readings as well for my etsy shops the crystals seen from the view the decks i have used for messages some of them are mine the other ones that are from my friends i'll leave it listed everything below if you're new consider subscribing like share this video it helps the channel so much and as always i wish you a lovely blessed and healing day thanks for watching